What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. This is Steven Turner. So today's video is just going to be, you know, a little bit different. I'm just kind of going to sit down and talk about the channel, you know, talk about the past year, everything that's happened in the past year and what my plans are for the future. So if you're wanting a crappy fishing video or a fishing video in general, this is not it. But if you're a little subscriber and you want to, you know, hear about the old channel and the business and all of that, stay tuned, check it out, hit the thumbs up button for me. So, take me old swig old monster here. I mean, I ain't going to do no fancy edits in this video. I'm probably just going to upload it straight just like it is unless I mess up somewhere in this video. But it's just going to be a lot of talking, honestly. So, if you stay around, stay tuned. I appreciate you, honestly. And honestly, I might give away some baits here in this video, so. Yeah, I'll probably give away some baits in this video. That'll work. Keep you around a little bit longer. Ah. So. Oh, excuse me. 2021. You know, wasn't as bad as 2020 with everything shut down. But. At the beginning of 2021, we had 1,000 subscribers on the channel. Mind blown. It took me about a year, year two years to get 1,000, which at the same time, I wasn't very consistent with uploading and, you know, I was making a lot of bass fishing videos, which is really saturated. So it really wasn't panning out. Now, I made the video... Uh, beginner crappy fishing the first one i made where i talked about my rod and reel setup and i went out there and i actually caught like nine crappy in a row and that video is still trucking i mean it's got like 130,000 views so i went to 1,000 subscribers really fast after that video blew up you know 2021 started you know we had the bass tournament season which we do every every year we fish the jackson farms tournaments which we plan on doing this year also you know that I, I know a lot of viewers on the channel don't really care for the bass fishing videos but i enjoy bass fishing tournaments and i'm still going to do them and i also enjoy the crappy tournaments as you've seen in one of the past videos that was really fun too just a competitive side of me just loves things like that so fast forward 2021 you know, everything's going good and making content, gaining subscribers, gaining subscribers. And then my truck tore up. It tore up in, I'm going to say July, somewhere around there. And it's still at the shop as I'm making this video. So it's been about eight months. But thankfully, I've been able to produce as much content as I possibly and able to muster up in this shop and going out with other people to keep the, to keep the channel going and we ended up getting 5,000 subscribers this year like freaking unreal now the goal for 2022 is obviously 10,000 subscribers but the side goal was 20 I want to go for 20 this year now hopefully in the next two months, I'll be able to get a vehicle, and then I'll be able to stick to my three videos a week schedule. Right now, I try to do two Mondays and Fridays, but that's really hard. I missed last week's videos, so this week I'll get two videos out. But it's really hard when you have to depend on other people to go fishing when you're trying to do a YouTube about fishing. <laughs> If you get my drift, I'm not complaining about it. I am very blessed to be in a position I am now. You know, over the course of 2021, we got a sponsorship with Waterlands Fishing, which is awesome. Uh, we've been in business here at Crappy Man Jigs for over a year now. And we, I mean, we have sold jigs throughout the entire country. I can't think of any state that I haven't shipped to. And that's just freaking awesome. So, what are my plans for 2022? <sighs> There's a lot of stuff on my mind, and how do I break it down? So 2022, we plan on getting 10,000 subscribers. So obviously, we're going to need the content to get 10,000 subscribers. 
you know, side plan, 20,000, that would be nice. But my strategy going thus far until I can get a vehicle to pull my boat to the lake and I actually go fishing, you know, pretty much on a day-to-day -day basis like I was doing and be able to go to different lakes like Monticello and all that, which I actually went to Monticello two weeks ago, caught one bass. <laughs> but... Oh, we found some cool stuff in Monticello, and I want to make a video about that. God, man. If I can get out there and actually get on what I've seen, that's going to be a fun video. But like I was saying, guys, I mean, this is going to be a long, long winded video. I'm just rambling. Just talking about the future of the channel and hopefully get a little bit more personal with you guys. But going forward in 2022... You know, here soon, we're going to get probably two more lineups of jigs. Now, if you're watching this video this far, if you have a suggestion for a type of jig that you would like us to produce, uh, these are small scale jigs. I don't want no three inches, none of that. 2.5 and below. Give us ideas on what profiles you're looking for and you know because i'm trying to expand the production we have you know because right now i mean i can get orders out the door pretty fast but as you can see this wall it's pretty empty because it's really hard to just sit here and make a lot at one time because we only have so many molds and they get so hot after so long so i'm trying to add more uh, molds. I'm trying to add different kinds. We actually have, I'll show you right here. This is actually one I picked up off a Chinese website. And it's a, it's a, a toad mold for bass fishing. And I mean, th this toad looks really good. I haven't uh, been able to fish with it yet because I got it in Oh, well, excuse me. They're not hitting top water right now, so hopefully I'm gonna be able to put that thing to work in the spring. Um, I have everything to do airbrushing now. Uh, if you follow me on Facebook, I post some of the stuff I airbrush. So I've been debating on getting into selling crankbaits and stuff like that. Actually, airbrushing them and selling them. Let me know down in the comments below if that would be cool. Um. Like I said, I'm trying to add about probably about two more jigs this year, a different kind of jig that we make. I want to get a bigger minnow, like the little minnow, as deadly as it is, I want to either find one that has, you know, the same type of tail that the little minnow has, that little straight tail. But would like maybe a two inch profile. Uh, we recently got the 32 ounce jig head uh, maker in stock and I bought it so that helped out production a lot because we were making one 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 thirty two ounce jig head at a time so but I'm thinking about adding one 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 sixteen ounces to the lineup also because I use that on my pole but I, I normally just make this myself like 10 of them or papa make me like 10 of them and i mean i use braid on a pole so one jig will last until the hook breaks pretty much but i don't know I, we've got everything to paint jig heads also but in my personal opinion crappies like lead jig heads and i just haven't seen the need to paint them because i mean i've bought painted jig heads before and fish side by side with the crappy man and he catches them five to one versus the painted head so i ain't never really seen the point to paint them unless i'm trying to catch people to buy them i mean i, I love getting orders and i love doing orders because that's the best way to support the channel is just to buy jigs i mean what kind of youtube channel is not asking you to just give them money i want you to just buy my jigs and go catch fish and me make a profit off the jigs that's the that's the whole thing <laughs> <coughs> oh but we want to add about two more, 
two more molds to it. I want to get a couple more bass fishing molds, maybe, you know, a worm and probably like a, a jig trailer, maybe, you know, and stuff like that. We've already got a swim bait mold. We don't really sell many of them. They're on the website, but I got to go through and take pictures of all the all the new uh, jigs and stuff because uh, there's there's a lot of colors on the website that don't have pictures of it just stuff like that and i know this is a, a long-winded video <laughs> but anyways that's pretty much my plans for 2022 i'm gonna get a vehicle a truck small truck suv something with a trailer hitch that can get my boat in that water and we're gonna go out there and slay them. But anyway, guys, if you made it this far in the video, I told you I was gonna give away some stuff. So comment down below some ideas for the video. I'm gonna do a random drawing in the next video. And I don't even know, I, I, a 50 pack of whatever you want. We're gonna do a 50 pack of whatever you want. And if you made it this far with me just talking, you deserve a 50 pack. But I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. And I can't not wait to get y'all on some more slabs this year. So stay tuned.